Hey folks, this is Adria, and I am going to do an updated version of my video which explains the TechSmith tools, uh, Camtasia Studio, Snagit, and Jing. Now, sometimes these products are used interchangeably. I'm going to explain what each one is, and then you can make the decision on which one is right for you. Now, Camtasia Studio is pretty much the flagship product of TechSmith. What is it? Camtasia Studio allows you to do screen recordings, right? You can also pipe in a webcam video. So you can create instructional videos, tutorials, however you want to call them. Some people call them screencasts. But that's what Camtasia Studio allows you to do. Uh, I've been using it since 2008, and I like it. It's great. It's very powerful. You have a lot of options. You can do transitions. You can you know, edit and slice your video. You can bring in additional audio. It's really great. It runs right now on the PC. You know, it's pretty much where most people use Camtasia Studio. Um, I love it. So you should definitely check it out. Now, the next tool, Snagit. What is that? Snagit is a screen capture tool. So it allows you to take screenshots. Now, you may be saying, well, Adria, I can already take screenshots by myself. I mean, why do I need a piece of software? Wait till you meet Snagit. Whoa, I love Snagit. Like, Snagit makes me weak in the knees. Why? It is an IT person's, like, I don't want to say it, but wet dream of screenshot tools. Now, why? You can, you can do so many things. Now, arrows are great. You know, boxes and shapes are great. Adding text is great. But, like, two of the things about Snagit that just, ooh, make me shudder. One is I have all these options on where I send my screenshots. I can uh, send them to Flickr. I can send them to WordPress. I can send them to Skype. I can send them to a Word document. So after I'm in there and I'm editing them and doing all these things, I can actually send them somewhere. I don't have to go through the lame process of saving them, opening up my other you know, application, whatever it is, and then bringing it in. So I love these targets. Uh, another thing is they introduce transparency. This is so slick. So now if I'm working with like a PNG, it, I can just add transparency easily. Also layering, you know, of, of different images. So I, I hate to say it, um, but in a way, Snagit has become for me like the poor man's Photoshop. Because a lot of things that I would do in Photoshop, really, they weren't that complex. They did not need Photoshop. But, I mean, you know, MS Paint just does not cut it. Uh, or I should say MS Paint can't cut it. MS Paint won't cut it. One of those is correct. Let's move on, though. <laughs> anyway, Snagit is great. So what would be the opposite of Snagit? Well, then you would just take a plain screenshot and you'd put it into a Word document, right? Not very exciting. I've done a ton of documentation. You know, you're writing instructions. Please click here, then do this. Love Snagit. Snagit is great. It allows for rapid uh, screenshots. You can actually even uh, take screenshots and have them auto-save with predefined file names. I mean, I can go on and on about Snagit. It's great. Now, a couple of years ago, Texma said, you know what, I think we need a tool that'll kind of introduce people to Camtasia Studio and to Snagit. What could we make? Ah, we know, Jing. So they <laughs> created this thing called Jing. And it's kind of, uh, you may see it on people's computers. It kind of hangs out in the top, uh, usually, of the screen, or you can put it over here. Anyway, it takes screenshots and short videos. And there's a free version, which is awesome, works on PC and Mac. Um, Oh, I suppose at this time I should say that Snagit is now available uh, on the PC and the Mac. In fact, I'll be doing a giveaway for Snagit for Mac. But moving back over to, to Jing. Um, so Jing is for PC and Mac. You can take screenshots, mark them up with text, you can do arrows, uh, you know, and you can send them a couple of places. Now, you can't send them as many places as you can send in Snagit. Uh, and then for the video, you can take up to five minutes of video, and then there's a plus version. And with the plus version, uh, you're able to uh, go ahead and get higher quality uh, audio and video. And I should say that there is a target available for Jing and for Camtasia Studio, the first thing I talked about. Both of those can send video directly to YouTube. How awesome is that? I know. So I'm really into tools that help you save time or help you cut out steps, right? So in my case, I'm just trying to put a video on YouTube. Now, if I can um, cut out the step of creating the file and then having to upload it, Thank you, TechSmith. Awesome. Now, there's a lot of features in all three of these products uh, that I could go into over and in more detail. But if you have questions about them, 
just leave a comment down below and I'd be more than happy to answer them. The last time I did this video, I think was like 2009, and people still watch that video. So I thought, you know, it's really time to do an update and just kind of give people my, I don't know, impression now in 2011 about these tools. And if you don't know the TechSmith team, let me just give a shout out to Betsy and Dirk and all the TechSmith folks. It's actually a really cool company. They're based out of Michigan. They listen to user feedback and they're really proactive. So that's also another aspect that I like. It's sometimes frustrating to work, um, uh, to, to, you know, be working on things that you need to get done. And then the tools you use, you know, when you, when you reach out and you're like, Hey, I need some help. It's like crickets, you know, in terms of support, not so a textment. They are very responsive, very active in social media. And they, they do a ton of blog stuff. They also do all sorts of fun. And let me just say silly things. So like if you were at South by Southwest and you saw their wigs, right? Because they were not rock stars. They were chalk stars. Um, <laughs> so with that, I'll wrap up this video. I would love to hear your questions or ideas or thoughts about Camtasia Studio, uh, about Snagit, uh, or about Jing. And like I said, I will be doing a special uh, video for Snagit for Mac. Um, I've been meaning to do this giveaway for a while, but finally, I'm going to get it done. Take care, guys. Bye.